Yeah. What's good, Wolves? Then it's your boy Locked Wolf, and I'm back at it again with another reaction. And I know I'm late, but weekends, family time, and I know stuff popped off and happened with um Drake, J. Cole, and Kendrick. But y'all saw I reacted to uh Kendrick's diss and Wow, he he just he just came straight for the jugular. Then y'all said it's cool, it's cool. Cole responded. J. Cole responded in his in his in his in his new project, might delete later with the song Seven Minute Drill. Now I've yet to see it, but stick around to the end of the video because we are then going to go to what I have heard. J. Cole then apologized. To Kendrick for what he said in this, which this I've never heard. Y'all know how we do it in here. Raw, authentic, first time reactions. I don't, I don't, I don't listen and then do it. Y'all get my authentic reaction. So without further ado, that being said, don't forget y'all. I invite you guys to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button if you have it. But we're about to dive into this. J. Cole, seven minute drill, first time reaction. Then we're going to see what he says in apologizing. Because honestly, in rap beef, Nobody want to hear some apologizing. So I didn't see what's going on. So let's get into it, y'all. First up, J. Cole, seven minute drill. Let's go. Yeah. Turn it up. Mm. Yeah. This beat hard. Uh, light work, like it's PWC. It's a cold world. Keep the heat under your seat. I got a phone call. They say that somebody dissing. You want some attention? It come with extensions. My dog like mm. say the word. Mm. Hold on. I called him saying someone dissing, but you want some attention. You try to say dot. Try to say Kendrick wants some attention. Hold on. But does Kendrick need attention? Does he? Somebody dissing, you want some attention, it come with extensions, my dog like say the word, he on bullshit, he itching, I'm putting so much work in these streets, he got pension, I told him mm. chill out, how I look having henchmen, if shots get to popping, I'm the one doing the clinching, I came mm. up in the air, so I'm good when it's tension, he's still doing shows, but fell off like the Simpsons, your first shit was classic. He's still doing shows, but fell off like the Simpsons. That's a straight shot at the Simpsons, too. Yeah, you better stop what they tell your future, Cole. <laughs> Yo, still doing shows. When it's tension, like he's still doing shows, but fell off like the Simpsons. Your mm. first shit was classic, your last shit was tragic. Your second shit put niggas to sleep, but they gassed it. Your third shit was massive, and that was your prime. I no, no, no. Look, look, if y'all also catch some of the reactions where I, I talk about, I talk people, I talk about my, my artists, I told y'all I'll be naming Drake, uh, not Drake, sorry, Cole, nothing wrong with Drake, but Cole and Kendrick is my most like prominent right now. And even me as a fan of both, you can't downplay Kendrick's catalog. Like Kendrick's catalog is, is everything from section on on four i came in on section so section 80 so so it's like bro I, i'm just saying you can't that that that's a wow i was a wild a wild one right there that was a wild bar but he was but cole talking his shit though that's the thing about this this battle rap but fell off like the Simpsons. Your first shit was classic. Your last shit was tragic. Your second shit put niggas to sleep, but they gassed it. Your third shit was massive, and that was your prime. I was trailing right behind, and I just now hit mine. Now I'm front of the line with a comfortable lead. How mm. I run it, so I got it. Now he wants something with me. What he caught me at the perfect time. <laughs> I'm, I'm at a comfortable lead. How Roddick is like, got it. He want to come after me. Ooh. I was right behind and I just now hit mine. Now I'm front of the line with a comfortable lead. How I run it, so I got it. Now he wants something with me. Well, he caught me at the perfect time. Jump up and see why I got here off of bars. Not no controversy. Funny thing about it, bitch, I don't even want the prestige. Fuck the Grammys, cause them crackers ain't never done nothing for me. Hey. Oh, to my nigga soul. Drugs took another one. A rap beef ain't realer than the shit I seen. Yo, that was a bar about yeah, that was a bar. He said they ain't never done nothing for me, so what do I care about that? Hold on. 
Fuck the prestige, fuck the Grammys, cause them crackers ain't never done nothing for me. Hope ah. slugs took my nigga soul. Drugs took another one. A rap beef ain't realer than the shit I seen in Cumberland. He averaging one hard burst like every 30 months or something. If he wasn't dissing, then we wouldn't be discussing him. Huh? Lord, don't make me. If we wasn't dissing, then we wouldn't be discussing him. Whoa, Cole is going wild. Yo, yo, y'all gotta let me know in the comments what y'all think. What y'all thought about this? Y'all gotta let me know. Y'all gotta let me know. I know, I know I'm late, but I, I, this is whoa. Cole was talking his shit. It's like every 30 months or something. If he wasn't dissing, I seen it. Oh, slugs took my nigga soul. Drugs took another one. A rap beef ain't realer than the shit I seen in Cumberland. He averaging one hard burst like every 30 months or something. If he wasn't dissing, then we wouldn't be discussing him. Huh? Lord, don't mm. make me have to smoke this nigga cause I fuck with him. But push come to shove on this mic, I will humble him. I'm Nino with this thing. It's that New Jack City meme. Yeah, I'm aiming at G Money crying tears before I busted him. Light that humble bar. I fuck with him, but push come to shove on this mic, I will humble him. I'm Nino with this thing, this that New Jack City meme. Yeah, I'm aiming at G Money, crying tears before I busted him. Light work, like it's PWC, it's a cold world. Keep the heat under your seat, I got a phone call. They say mm. somebody dissing, you want some attention, it come with extensions. My dog, say word. He on bullshit, he itching, I'm putting so much work in these streets, he got pension. I told him, chill out. I look having henchmen of shots get the popping. I'm the one doing the conductor, conductor, conductor. Yo, okay, B switch. That was nasty. Conductor, conductor, conductor. Okay. I got mixed feelings about these fucking rap niggas. It's over for that cap. The official cap pillars two six. We don't act niggas. We get at niggas. Shoot uh. a nigga lights out. Yeah, my dog stat fillers, stat stuffers, triple double. Get your ass black. Shoot his lights out. Yeah, my niggas stat fillers. Oh my god. A niggas pat stat. Oh. Dang. This was nasty. What made Cole want to apologize for this? This is this is the response you want. From what, from, from what Kendrick said? And then this, this? I'm baffled. Cap, the official cap, pillars two six. We don't act niggas, we get at niggas. Shoot a nigga lights out. Yeah, my dog, stat fillers, stat stuffers. Triple double, get your ass black duffel. Body bag, body bag, body bag. Cold world, your instructor for Pilates class. Get a nigga stretched if I feel a disrespect. Your arms mm. might be too short to box with the God who lives his life without the pressures of a constant facade. I pray for peace, but if a nigga sees these positive vibes, a Falcon 9 inside my pocket, bitch, this rocket gonna fly. Now oh, Falcon 9 inside my pocket, bitch, this rocket gonna fly. Yo, 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 Cole, like this doesn't disturb my peace, and y'all don't have, won't, won't have no smoke and no war with me. Yo, this whole time, he's he been talking this shit from, from downplaying. From, from definitely dissing and downplaying Kendrick's work to saying he ain't relevant because the only reason he needed to be relevant was come after me because I'm on top with a comfortable lead. Like, and then he going and saying that you come after his PC on body bag. You Cole had a lot to say in three minutes and 32 seconds. That's crazy. With the God who lives life without the pressures of a constant facade. I pray for peace, but if a nigga sees these positive vibes, a Falcon 9 inside my pocket, bitch, this rocket gon' fly. Now it's popping outside like the top of July. My text flooded with the hunger for a toxic reply. I'm hesitant, I love my brother, but I'm not gonna lie. I'm uh. powered up for real, that shit would feel like swatting a fly. Uh, I love my brother, but I'm powered up. He's like, I love that, like, look. No, I like y'all never had, you know, a friendship where y'all done said some foul shit, not super foul, but, you know, said some foul shit or disagreed and said some, talk some shit to your homie and y'all went at it for a minute talking shit, not being friends, just to come back and be like, hey, man, I apologize, but that shit was, hey, it, that, good shit, you know? You know, sometimes me and my friends back in the day, my mid-20s were like, we talk shit, like, all right, let's go outside, we'll throw hands. Hands ready to eat for everyone. We'll throw hands to settle it. Come back inside, bruised up, drinking, playing the game. But Cole came after some jugular. He, I wonder if Drake gonna respond. Let me know in the comments. Y'all think Drake gonna respond? My brother, but I'm not gonna lie. I'm powered up for real. That shit would feel like swatting the fly. Four albums in 12 years, nigga. I can divide. Shit, if this is what you want, I'm indulging in violence. Put pictures in my home. Aim the chrome at your eyelids. Fly pebbles at your dome. We 
just stone temple pilots. This is merely a warning shot. The back niggas down, back in the town where they whipping, working, trafficking pounds. My jack jumping about a rapper, making blast from his sounds. Yo, he said this is a warning shot just to calm your ass down and put you back in your place. That's wild. Don't tip I, hey, yo. This is merely a warning shot. The back niggas down, back in the town where they whipping, working, trafficking pounds. My jack jumping about a rapper, making blast from his sounds. Switching sides like the tassel on the cap and a gown. I'm fully loaded, nigga. I can drop two classics right now. <laughs> I can drop two out, classics. Yo, fall off. He said, I'm so loaded, I can drop I can drop two classics right now. I'm fully loaded, nigga. I can drop two classics right now. Let me chill out, man. Conductor. Fall off on the way, nigga. Fall off on the way. Yo. What? Yo, that was hot. That was hot. But what made Cole? What what made Cole go from that to apologize? I found I found a a, a video on YouTube. I want to see it because like, come on, Cole, what you apologizing? Because that was fire. That was fire. That was what rap beef is like. But apologizing, like, come on, man, nobody. I don't want to hear that. I mean, let's go. I'm so proud of that project, except for one part. It's one part of that shit that make me feel like, man, that's the lamest shit I ever did in my fucking life, right? And I know this is not what a lot of people want to hear. I know I can hear my niggas up there right now, like, Yo, the lamest nah, shit he ever. Nah, I don't do that, but I the got, lamest shit he ever done. Me, okay, I, I, I didn't see where he coming from as a human, as I a human keep being. With y'all, right? I damn near had a relapse, right? Because y'all heard some shit that happened two, two, three weeks ago. However long it was. Y'all, y'all, y'all heard that bazooka that was dropped on the motherfucking game, right? Talking about the the Kendrick diss with the future and Metro, okay, okay. So all of this time of me moving on my own accord, for the first time I was tested. Why am I tested? Cause I got the world, and I got my niggas like, what you gonna do, Cole? <laughs> <My niggas laughs> I mean, like, Bit boy, I yeah, had a thousand missed calls. Oh my fucking god. Text flooded. I couldn't even answer my shit. Nigga, it's war time. <laughs> <laughs> it's war time. Blood. And I want to say we want to see blood. We want to see a good a rap like, like y'all. You, 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 and you and Kendrick are are rap giants. I'm even. I'm even. I'm even throw throw Drake in there. But I'm like a part time Drake listener, you know. So you know, don't, don't come for me. But you know, but still, for me, like those are two like. Rap giants and they're going back and forth. We just wanted to see some lyrical ass this this rap this tracks. A good beef, a good this. It's apologizing. This apologizing shit is a little bit getting to me as a person who grew up around hip hop. It's like because in my head, you know, being around the, you know, growing up in the nineties as a nineties baby and, and watch you know watching Pac and Biggie's beef. In my head, I'm like, what if Pac would apologize? What if Biggie would apologize? Like that's like Pac. That's like pop making. I, I don't know. That's like who shot, who who shot you coming out and then apologizing to like, I, I I don't know. I don't know. But we gotta hear it out. I just feel like them two. That that this should have been just a, a nice beef. But let's see what Cole. I, I'm just saying, as a hip hop head, it's like, huh? Apologizing after a response. And I was conflicted because. One, I know my heart. You know and by hip-hop I mean? head, like, I mean I just grew, I grew I up in the hip-hop. You know, I'm still learning. My peers, these two niggas that i just been blessed to even stand beside in this game, let alone chase, chase their greatness, right? So I felt conflicted because I'm like, bro, I know I don't really feel no way. But the world want to see blood. I don't know if y'all can feel that, but the world want to see blood. Yeah. So I say all of that to say, in my spirit of trying to, like, get this music out, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I moved in a way that was, that I feel spiritually feel bad on me. Like, like I try to like jab my nigga back and I try to keep it friendly. But at the end of the day, when I listen to it and when it comes out and I see the talk, that shit don't sit right with my spirit. That shit make me feel, that shit disrupts my fucking peace. So what I want to say right here tonight is in the midst of me doing that and, and in that shit, okay. trying to find a little angle 
and downplay this, this nigga's fucking uh, catalog and his greatness. I want to say right now tonight, how many people think Kendrick Lamar is one of the greatest motherfuckers that ever touch a fucking microphone? Yeah. Look, everybody think the same thing. We Kendrick, just want to see love me. Kendrick Lamar, correct? Yeah. Bob Dog, we love, we love Cole. I, Dream, we so love I just want to come up here and be like, like, publicly be like, bro, that was the lamest, like, goofiest shit. And it make, I say all that to say, it made me feel like 10 years ago when I was moving incorrectly. And I pray that God align me back up on my purpose and on Bruh. my path. You know what I mean? I pray that my nigga really didn't feel no way. And if he did, my nigga, I got my chin out. Take your best shot. I'm going to take that shit on the chin, boy. Do what you do. You know what I mean? Like, all good. Like, it's, it's love. And I pray that, you know, I pray that y'all are like, forgive a nigga for like the misstep and then, and then I can get back to my true path because I ain't going to lie to y'all. The past two days felt terrible. Like, it let me know how good I've been sleeping for the past 10 years. So all of that to say, man, I want to I wanna now perform the song that's a reminder to me of getting back on the right path and getting in tune with God. And the name of the song is called Love Yours. I want to do that for y'all right now. You know what? Okay, you know what? I ain't gonna lie, as a human being on a mental and a spiritual level, I feel cold. I feel, I feel cold where you're not bothered by someone. So me personally, if I'm not bothered by someone, I'm not going to give it a reaction. I'm not going to, I'm not going to respond. You know, I'm not going to say nothing to that, but it's like, if I do it and I feel like I'm, I felt like I moved in a way. That wasn't what I wanted to do. My intentions, spiritually, what I wanted to do, ain't going to sit right. And that's how you know he's on a different path. So as a human, I get him. I, I, I get Cole 100%. Like He's like, I moved foul spiritually. I just hope y'all can forgive me because he's like, that's not how I want to do things. I don't want to stay where I'm at or, or keep climbing the ladder of this music shit by downplaying and, and, and being down on my dude. Even though Kendrick did it, Kendrick did it. Now, how Kendrick move, how Kendrick move, how Cole want to move, that's how Cole want to move. I feel him. But as a rap fan and someone who just grew up in the 90s, who just grew up around hip-hop and rap and stuff, I don't want to hear that shit, Cole. We un I understand, but I want to hear that shit, man. I wanted, I wanted, I wanted to see a, 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 some, hear some good diss tracks, some lyrically good diss tracks. We all know y'all homies. We know at the end of the day, y'all gonna talk y'all shit and then apologize. But at the same time, you know me, I, I have theories. One of this was a ploy because Cole, Drake, and Kendrick are working on an album together or something. I'm about to come out with a track or something. Like, what if this was just like publicity, you know? Let me know what you guys think in the comments. But, uh, you know, I get him as a human being, but as someone who kind of like, was one of the people who wanted war, wanted blood, just to have a back and forth. I don't hear that shit. But again, big ups to Cole for 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 realizing as a man who he is spiritually, how he, how he wants to move, and apologizing because he wanted that off of his shoulder. So big ups to him. Big ups to you, you guys for tuning in, sticking around for the first time reactions to Seven Minute Drill. Then the first time reactions is apologizing. I just felt like since I was already late, there was no point in splitting it up. So. Thank you guys. If you made it this far in your video, please, I invite you to hit that thumbs up, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. And if you haven't, go to the original link down at the bottom. It'll take you to 7 Minute Drill to J. Cole's channel. Hit it with the sub, the like, support the homie. I appreciate y'all. Until next time, you know what time it is. It's your boy Lockwolf. Always for it. Never back to saying shit back there for you unless you're a hater. And delay does not mean denied. So keep pushing. Keep going no matter what. No matter the obstacles. I love y'all. Your boy's out. Peace.